Building time. Building time. Who will win and who will fall? Find out when we burn the wall. It's building time. This is Stampy, and welcome to another episode of Building Time, the series where Squid and me need to build in time. Yay! Hi, Stamps. You better. My, my, my portions of wet. I'm, I have, I've You're been, I've been punching mules and lying in baths of lava all week, and I'm out of the hospital now. Yeah. We can get rid of this hospital because I am feeling fine. Yeah, he's feeling, feeling. Fine. Oh no, no, there squid, no, go. squid, this, we, don't need to just. Oh, this isn't going to end. Oh, brilliant. There we go. Oh, this is the, um, that speeded up the process. Your cake, okay, squid. <laughs> you're cleaning the right now. Fill this up because I've, 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 this will be left forever until it drives me I crazy. Can, I can and then cover I have this to do up. It. I can cover this up. That's with dirt. With up, dirt. Yeah. Make it look the way it was. Beauty. No, this. Got, that, oh. Let's put a few mules in there. <laughs> mules are your do. answer to everything. <laughs> I've got this. I've got this. Oh, it's fine. Why do they do like a, a TNT that explodes grass blocks, like a healing block of TNT? That that should be pretty good. You should do that. <laughs> I, don't, no? I just don't think it'd be TNT. Not then. Catch on. You just just use your hand, Squid. Don't be lazy. Right. Well, while Squid's uh, doing that, uh, I'm going to reveal the uh, the revolt from uh, the revolts. The results. Revolt. I'm revolting. <laughs> I don't want to I tell know you're revolting, results. Squid. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Can we just keep one mule? We'll keep oh, one mule. It's there. so nice just to hear yeah. you screaming. I'm revolting. <laughs> 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 right, so I'm not going to bother showing you what we built last week. I'm sure you saw it, um, but yeah, because it's all the way over there. But we built the uh, the disco dance night arenas, whatever. And uh, I was very poorly, and the uh, the results are: uh, Squid got 105,000 votes, and I got 130,000 votes. What? I think there's a good chance that I got the pity vote because I was really ill, and I... <laughs> everybody felt sorry for you. <laughs> Did you see my video at all, Squid? Did you? Like, uh, I literally didn't speak. I was, I was just playing disco music in the background. But what happens is when when I edit it, I can only see, like, the, the waves of our voices and uh, stamps had, like, a massive gap. And I was like, what's he doing here? It's like, half of the video is just quiet. I was actually, like, so, uh, for, for a point, I literally just bent over coughing. Like, there's, I cut it out. There's a bit where I just wasn't even playing. I was standing there. So I was disadvantaged. So thank you, everyone, for, for voting for me. But make sure you do <laughs> vote on not who you want to win. You just vote on whoever <laughs> built the best thing. Okay, so kind of ignore that it's me against Squid. Just vote on the builds, okay? That that's the the way to make it. That's most what fair. I'm gonna do this week. I'm just gonna stand in the middle of my little building area and just vote for coughing. me. Just I'm just <laughs> I'm gonna spend just the full 15 minutes just saying why you should vote for me, but not build anything. I just be here like I know I didn't build anything, <laughs> but I try really hard and I'm really nice and I'm really funny and I think you should you'd vote for me you'd because probably my still win. Really nice. that's, that's the thing that's <laughs> upsetting about you. You probably still win stuff. I just or I could just try and hypnotize them, like look into my eyes. Yeah. You want want to vote for Stampy. Squid is revolting. <laughs> anyway. Oh, and what's this? There's a... Ducky was here. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I wonder who put that down. Right. Do you, uh, you want to pull the uh, the lever? Yeah, let's do it. We have got... Uh, we have to build Emily or Dowled. Dowled. We have to build Emily, <laughs> we have to build Emily or Dowled. And that was suggested by Funfair. Like. <laughs> does, does she have... Does she have um, face? I don't, but I don't know what account. she looks like. Um, no. We just... um, <laughs> we have to build an Emily. We have to build Emily wow. O'Dowd. <laughs> what a strange name. By I Funfair. don't know who she is. This is really difficult. <laughs> okay, so suggested by Emily O'Dowd, we have to build a fun fair. Ooh. All right, I'm getting my I'm getting my potions ready. Ah, wow! <laughs> Think something's not changed. I'm getting my potions ready. Oh, come on, as if you know. I'm gonna get oh, mine. Actually, really. I got a bad one. I got one that only gave me it for a minute. Ah. There you go. This one give it for eight oh, minutes. Oh no! Stamps. I have two of these. I'm set for the eight time. Eight minutes. Eight minutes of wow. of swiftiness. Of swift right, building. Right, okay. I'm gonna stretch. Oh, get my building on. Ugh. You ready, right. Squid? I'm ready. Three. Yeah. Two. Remember to move your mic. One. <laughs> Go! Hi. Right, Mike, am I muted? Am I muted? Can you hear me, Squid? Squid cannot hear me, I don't think. So we are good to start building. Right, uh, thank you for everyone who was uh, really nice uh, sending get well messages uh, from last week. Uh, I really do uh, appreciate that. And uh, let's forget about that now, though, because we're doing this week. So uh, I want to build a, uh, a Ferris wheel. 
I think that's going to be the first thing. What I'm going to do is I'm going to do like a, a mini fun fair. Okay, so I'm going to do like a mini Ferris wheel and a mini roller coaster. Uh, maybe some mini dodgems. Uh, just as many small things because uh, I keep trying to build uh, too big and uh, it keeps kind of not ending very well for me. So uh, instead of that, I'm going to build uh, a little bit smaller and uh, try and actually get something done for once. So <laughs> let's try and do the, uh, the big old Ferris wheel then. I guess if I do just like uh, a circle like this... And then if I go down one, two, three here, uh, hopefully this is going to fit. Oh, I don't know if this is going to fit in, is it? No, let's just do, um, let's get rid of this here. And uh, let's go down like this. And it's going to be, as I said, a little kind of mini Ferris wheel. Uh, so what I could do it is uh, kind of, you know, like my fireworks, where I did it as if like, you're looking at it from really high up. I could kind of do it in that kind of style. So as if you're uh, looking at a, um... Uh, a fun fair, uh, which is really far away. I think that could uh, end up looking pretty cool. And so I'm just going to try and just do uh, hopefully more uh, than what Squid's doing. Uh, and oh, I've done this wrong as well, haven't I? This is supposed to go one, two, three here. And then this is here. So there we go. This is my, um, oh, this is my fairest wheel, apparently. Oh, this is wrong here. This goes like this, and I'm wasting way too much time on this, aren't I? So this then needs to go like that there. And then here, this goes like that. Does this work? There we go. There is my Ferris wheel now. <laughs> and then let's do this uh, blue block. Uh, blue block, black in the uh, the middle there. And then let's do uh, some iron bars, maybe. Uh, looking like they're holding the, the entire thing up. So it's going to be like lots of uh, little mini things like this. So this is the, uh, the Ferris wheel. It looks like a steering wheel to a car, doesn't it? But I'm too deep in now. Uh, there's no real time to change it. So let's kind of do some uh, supports holding the uh, the entire thing up. And then let's go and do a roller coaster, shall we? And this is going to be uh, the roller coaster, I guess, will be a little bit bigger because uh, I want it to be actually rideable. And Squid uh, did actually try building a, a roller coaster in a, a past um, uh, video, uh, but it didn't go very well. It wasn't actually rideable. It didn't work. So <laughs> let's try and do an actual working roller coaster then, shall we? Uh, let's do like a, a rickety old wooden one, shall we? Because uh, I think they're kind of the, the cooler looking ones. And this can kind of be uh, quite uh, front and center, pride of place at uh, the uh, the very start. Let's kind of do it down like this. Uh, so this is the, the beginning, and then you can uh, make your way up like this here. Uh, this is going to be like kind of the uh, the peak. You know, there's the, the slow, gradual climb uh, that you do at the uh, the beginning of the, the roller coaster, and then it can kind of whiz down to the uh, the side uh, down here. I'm a little bit scared about how close I'm building it to the uh, the wall because <laughs> I know that thing is going to be burning soon. So this is the uh, the first big drop uh, that the uh, the roller coaster is going to do. And it's going to go down to about here. And I'm going to try and make it uh, so it pretty much uh, only works from uh, momentum. Because uh, if you don't know that roller coasters, uh, the only power that powers them is going up. Once they've gone up, they kind of just go down and it's just gravity uh, that powers them. So I'm going to see if I can kind of uh, make Make my one do that as well and it might not work but I'm gonna give it a go so it can then go uh, back out like this and as you can see I'm trying to be building much quicker uh, than I have been uh, in the uh, the past I think uh, overall uh, I've been probably a little bit too slow with the uh, the things that I've been building so I'm doing less time thinking and panicking and uh, changing my mind and uh, more time actually building so we can now go and whiz around like this and then back down the other way here we could drop down a little bit uh, just to make sure it has enough momentum and uh, go back to where we started and this can kind of be uh, the rough idea of what my uh, roller coasters are going to, to be. Uh, but then, of course, I need to actually add the uh, the track on it. So I guess it's going to be mainly power rails uh, leading up here. Uh, just to make sure it can make its way uh, up to the uh, the top. Uh, and then this one, I think, needs to be a normal track because the uh, the power rails can't turn. And uh, yeah, then the rest can hopefully uh, be normal ones. But I'm going to give it a little bit of a, a test to ride uh, to make sure it is actually possible to go and uh, there's no bits that don't work. Like, is this bit going to work? Oh, it does. There we go. Uh, sometimes it's a little bit weird in terms of when it can turn and when it's going up or down. And this is a, a quite a, a nice little cute roller coaster. And uh, so what else could I do? So I could do a, or maybe a Helter Skelter. Uh, a Helter Skelter might be quite a cool thing. You know, like the big twirl slides uh, that you go down. Uh, that might be uh, quite a fun thing to do. And also the, the dodgems. I could do boat dodgems because they actually work. I think uh, doing things that actually work uh, might be a, a nice way to get some bonus points. But the roller coaster doesn't work uh, because I put the, the lever in a place where it wasn't powering it. There we go. Uh, this now works. Uh, let's go give it a, a ride then, shall we? Let's go and uh, put down a, a minecart. Uh, let's sit in and uh, let's go. So going up works and then whoa, whoa and like that. There we go. And then back around the, the other side. It works absolutely beautifully. <laughs> right. So uh, what I can do then is if I make uh, a little raise bit here, uh, so then that way you don't kind of keep endlessly going round and you kind of need to go and set it off. So if I do that there and then go and put some normal tracks here, and I'm probably spending a little bit too much time on this, but it's okay. And then this way, uh, the minecart should kind of just stop here and then you need to go and set it off. And if I just add a, uh, a button in, maybe... Uh, oh, no, 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 don't go, don't go. If I put a button in here, maybe, uh, this should be uh, enough to go and uh, set it off. So if I go and place this uh, button right about there... 
And what I'm also going to do is I'm going to add some uh, some fences in. Uh, so then that way. Uh, it can be as if the uh, the entire thing uh, is being held up by these fences. And I guess this is a uh, uh, very similar uh, to the uh, the way that the uh, the creeper coaster uh, is in my lovely world. If you've seen that, and that uh, is based off the uh, the kind of old fashioned traditional roller coasters uh, that used to be made out of wood. <laughs> and there is actually a roller coaster, a roller coaster nearby where I live, which I have ridden and is very scary. And it is still just completely made out of wood. Apart from the actual tracks, the entire thing is wood, and it's rickety and it's scary. And you're not scared because of the drops. You're scared that the whole thing is just going to fall apart. <laughs> and that is kind of uh, like what roller coasters uh, used to all be like. And uh, that is what this one's based off. So let's go and uh, fill all of this uh, in here. And uh, then we can go and uh, let's try and do the uh, let's try and do the, the dodgems next. Because uh, that's something uh, that might take up quite a, a lot of room. And I want to make sure that I can kind of do that first. And then I can work out what else I can do uh, to fit it all around it. So let's go and add uh, a few more supports down here. Uh, just like that. And uh, maybe just some here. Because this bit uh, looks like it all might uh, fall apart. So let's go and uh, add that in there. All right then, let's go and do the, the old dodgems then. Let's do some nice bright colourful colours. I guess red and white uh, might be a, a nice colour to, to do. I'm going to have a, a, a Narva Swiftness Potion and then let's go and get this built then, shall we? So I'm going to do just the uh, the outline around here. I'm just going to alternate between red and white like this. And this is basically just going to be like a, a pool of water uh, with just boats in. And then you can basically just go and uh, bang into all of the, the other ones. And I think this might be a good side. I just need to, to make sure it all kind of lines up right uh, with the, uh, the pattern that I'm doing. Hopefully I'm going to get lucky. And there we go! Absolutely! Absolutely perfect, and then I can do kind of the the same uh, checkered pattern uh, on the uh, the floor like this. So if I kind of just do every color like this, and I am going to be putting um. Uh, water on top of this anyway, uh, but you are going to be able to, to see it through the uh, the water. So let's go and uh, get this done as fast as we can. Then if I fill it full of water, add some uh, some boats in, uh, then these are going to be the uh, the dodgems. So uh, I think this is going to look quite cool. And then what else could I add? Oh, so there's the Helter Skelter. I could also add like a, a haunted house maybe. I am running out of room and even though I am doing everything miniature, uh, I do want to make sure I can at least uh, fit in uh, everything that I want to fit in and for it to, to look like uh, what it's uh, supposed to be. So I did that floor uh, pretty quickly there if I do say so myself. Uh, so let's just go and uh, fill this entire thing uh, full of water and uh, throw some boats in and then this could be some dodgems. And if I do have time at the end, I might add like a, a roof to this area, kind of make it look like a, a tent or something. That's kind of how they often are. Uh, but for now, let's go and throw the, the boats in and then these are the uh, the dodgems that you can go and bounce around in. This is cool because most of these things that I'm building, uh, you can actually ride. And I think I will do the uh, the haunted house because I've done the roller coaster. I think the, uh, the helter skelter uh, might look uh, a little bit similar. So instead, uh, let's go and try and do uh, a nice spooky uh, haunted house then shall we so uh, they're normally kind of just wooden and uh, and rickety so let's go and uh, mark out the area it's going to be and uh, yeah it's going to be pretty small I don't <laughs> have uh, have much room uh, to do it very big and I don't have much time uh, to build it very big either so I think uh, this might probably be uh, the last thing I have time to do and sorry cow you were in my way I had to give you a little bit of a, a gentle nudge <laughs> so let's try and uh, build it like this if I do up the uh, the sides like this and I want to actually add something spooky I don't want to just do the uh, the outside of it I want to have time to do some stuff uh, on the uh, the inside uh, as well. So let's go and uh, build this up like this. And I guess I can alternate like this. Just, no, no, just to make it look a, a little bit different uh, so it's not too boring. And I can do the front like this here. And then there can be, I guess, double doors uh, can be there. And I can go and build this like this and like this. Uh, I'm not planning. I I've, got a, I've got a new strategy. And rather uh, than spending uh, a lot of time thinking, I'm just building and it's kind of working. I think I'm getting a, a lot more done uh, a lot quicker uh, without spending time thinking about it. Because if I'm normally trying to build, I would spend absolutely ages uh, thinking about what materials and where to put it and what the design is uh, but in a, a quick build like this uh, you really kind of just want to build 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 and that is really uh, what I'm trying to, to do now so uh, let's go and uh, add a, a roof onto the uh, the area here uh, I think I'll do it like this way round. If I do these uh, along here like this, and then I'll do these along the, the other side like this here, and then let's fill in with some jungle wood just to make it look different. Kind of, They kind of want to look ugly, don't they? This isn't supposed to be a, a nice looking house. It's supposed to be kind of an ugly, spooky house. So uh, let's just go and uh, add these in here like this. And uh, once again, I'm not thinking about what I'm building with. I am just placing blocks, and it does seem to uh, be doing a pretty good job. So let's go and fill this uh, uh, this top bit in here with jungle wood, and I'm probably going to add a, uh, a chimney uh, on it as well. Uh, uh, out of a uh, stone, I would probably guess. But uh, let's go and fill all of this in here first, and then we're going to add the the chimney in, and then I need to go and add some spooky things. And I think it's good because Squid is going to have a, a chance to go and actually uh, walk around uh, the uh, the entire place that I've built and uh, ride all of the the rides, which should just be a, a lot more fun uh, rather than just kind of just looking at what I've built. So apart from the the Ferris wheel, uh, which is looking at a little bit tiny and pathetic now, <laughs> everything uh, is actually kind of interactable. So this is the the chimney. I could have it like a, a little bit crumbled as well. If I go and add like. Uh, 
some half slabs maybe and some stairs as well and then that way I can kind of have like uh, some bits that look a bit destroyed there could maybe be like a, a gap there and a gap down here as well and maybe a, another stair there uh, just so it looks uh, a little bit uh, destroyed and then I'm also going to go and add some um, uh, some what they called cobwebs. I'm going to add some cobwebs in, uh, which can be like the uh, the smoke, uh, which is going to be bellowing from the uh, the top of the uh, uh, the chimney like this. If I kind of go up and then to the side a bit, I can't go out of the uh, the area though. Even though uh, I'm above the area, I can't go uh, uh, much further to the uh, the side uh, than I have here. But I think that looks okay. Uh, this is kind of a quite a nice spooky house. That looks quite scary. <laughs> I'd be scared to go in there. Uh, so let's go and add some steps here, as uh, so we can actually uh, get into it uh, like this. And then let's go and add down some doors. Always. I think these are probably the uh, the spookiest ones because uh, you can't see inside either and then this is the uh, the haunted house So it wants to be quite dark in here So uh, let's only add uh, uh, some uh, some redstone torches up here uh, Just to light it up ever so slightly and uh, then we can have some uh, some jack-o'-lantern ghosts Maybe uh, could be floating uh, around the uh, the place. Uh, so let's go and uh, add in um, I guess like this these could be some uh, some spooky ghosts Maybe <laughs> uh, if I do one there and uh, one here it'd be good to do like a train going around uh, but there's really not enough time or room to do that and actually I could get rid of these redstone lights because the uh, uh, the jack-o'-lanterns uh, kind of light up the area anyway and I want something other than the the ghost let's add a, a zombie in as well shall we uh, let's go and actually let's do a dark green uh, rather than light green and uh, let's add a uh, an evil zombie uh, could be uh, down here and oh there's a, a hole in the the ceiling um, and that's okay it's kind of nice to have a, a little hole as well and uh, then this guy can have his uh, his spooky arms going <laughs> there's the other uh, zombie as well so there we go uh, that is my uh, my horn house uh, which is going to be right about there that's looking uh, pretty cool uh, not too shabby and uh, what else could I add in then could I add the uh, the helter skelter or maybe like a dropper ride what else do you always get at fun fest I could do like a candy uh, like a stand that might be something that I ever have time to do so once again uh, let's make this a uh, very bright and colorful let's do this uh, orange and yellow and uh, let's do like uh, a stand here uh, that could be selling like a uh, cotton candy or a uh, candy floss as it's called if you're in the uh, the UK uh, maybe just selling some sort of a uh, nice tasty treat stand and is this gonna fit in yay once again I got it perfect to make it fit in so I'm gonna do the uh, the same bright and colorful checkered pattern uh, that I did with the uh, the dodgems and oh I'm getting it wrong though let's do this one there and then these need to be uh, yellow along here and then on top of the orange ones uh, you can do checkered patterns really quickly if you kind of do them like this uh, you can fill them in uh, pretty fast and then uh, I want to have uh, an opening here as well if I guess I have a, a different color roof uh, just to make it stand out I haven't used blue very much uh, so let's go and have a, a blue roof like this and uh, this is where they can be selling uh, all of the uh, the different treats uh, that you might get at a, at a fun fair so this can kind of go uh, out slightly here. I can probably go out one further and not get in the way of the roller coaster. Then I'm just going to use some uh, some fences uh, to go and uh, be holding the entire place up. <laughs> and I realize that the faster I build, I think the faster I speak as well. I think I need to, to speak quicker to keep up with how fast my brain is working to try and <laughs> uh, build all of these things quickly. So uh, here we go. Let's go and add these fences down here. Uh, this is looking... It's a bit weird, but this is okay. <laughs> and then we can go and add some torches on the, the background here. And then we can have some different things that they have for sale. So we can't actually sell uh, cotton candy, but they can be selling apples. And what else is another? Oh, cookies and cake, of course, as well. So let's go and uh, have uh, all the different types of apples and the cookies on the uh, the background there. And then we can also add some cake down here. And then what else? Something that they could sell that would be quite nice. Um, and eggs. And they sell eggs. Let's get rid of uh, one of those apples. And uh, let's put down uh, some nice tasty eggs uh, that they sell here. Hello. And uh, that's a uh, Time up. Hello, Stabs. Hello. Hello, Squid Nugget. Hello. Hello. How did that go? Um, I think it went okay. That was like, <laughs> that I, I blinked and the time was gone, Squid. Yeah. Goes pretty quick, doesn't it? Yeah. I also forgot to uh, start my timer, so I wasn't actually sure when it was ending, so I was just waiting for you to speak, so. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I, got, I, I, got, I got it done, though. I got it done. Okay, so uh, shall we Shall we do what needs to Burn be done? Wall. Burn the 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 wall. And then wait for the wall to burn really slowly. I'm scared. I built <laughs> burn faster. I built something out of wood quite close. I'm a little bit nervous. I'm keeping a closer oh. eye this time. <laughs> oh no. Oh. Can we do mine first before my my animals disappear? Uh yeah, sure. Let's check it out. I think we've done quite similar actually. Have we? I think so. I think so. I've done um. I've done a roller coaster. We've, that actually worked we've done once. really. Oh, this is weird. Okay, anyway, so carry on, Squid. Okay, <laughs> so this is my roller coaster. Do you want to ride it? Yeah, it's very this similar to your other one, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, but my other one didn't work, so I kind of wanted just to set things Whee! right. So. That's a, that that was go. a little bit too exciting for me, Squid. <laughs> this is my Ferris wheel. Very nice, very nice. Um, yeah, this is this is the cake shop. They seem to be having fun. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my merry-go-round. Oh, this is so cool. 
<laughs> oh, you could have done it so you actually put saddles on the horses and actually ride it. <laughs> I know, but I like it. It's good. Oh, man. I couldn't figure out how to, like, trap them in, so I just put them in glass. But I think it works well. And they look happier away. <laughs> this is nice. This is good. Like, I've done really similar... Like, okay, 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 let me show you mine. So I've done a roller coaster. I did a, this is, yep. this is my Ferris wheel. <laughs> it looks like a steering <laughs> wheel. I, so my, my idea was originally that as if you're looking at it like from far away, so it's all tiny, but then I ended up just building yeah. stuff bigger and bigger. So do you want to ride my roller coaster? Yeah. So it's authentic it. in the fact that um, it, there's only power rails to go up and then it's all just powered by gravity after that. So that's oh, a little, a little added very nice. an old wooden roller coaster. So this is my, uh, it's supposed to be like a candy store with like candy cane and stuff, but um, it sells eggs and cake. <laughs> if you nice. want an egg eggs at the and fun cake. fair. That's these, what you want at Ferris Field. These, these, these are my dodgems. <laughs> if you want, do you want to go in the dodgems? Ah, oh, this is cool. Yeah. I like this. The, uh, yeah. Fast paced, exciting yeah. dodgems. <laughs> ah, it can't seem to break you up. Oh, hey! oh there we go. <laughs> and then you hit each other with sticks. That's the, uh, the next part of the game. Nice. <laughs> and then the, you can probably guess what this is. Can you guess? Oh, is it a haunted house? Oh, it's spooky. All oh, the doors oh. are flapping by themselves. Oh, <laughs> that wasn't me. <laughs> Cool. That's pretty good. They're so similar. Like, look at the roller yeah, coaster, similar. and then the. I mean, your Ferris wheel is better, but then like the cake shop, like is really similar to mine. It's it's a little yeah. bit weird how how our minds Seems. worked in the same way. <laughs> I mean, I was literally gonna try and build uh, Emily or Dowd, but you know, <laughs> that would have been a funny Ferris twist. <laughs> I, I burn the wall, and there's just like a girl on the other side. This is Emily. <laughs> 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 oh dear. Right oh, then, man. we have done our part, and now it's time for your part. So you can vote in the way you do every week. Uh, if this is the first week you've seen, uh, there'll be a little uh, icon on the top of the screen, uh, and it will say vote for Squid and vote for Stampy. Uh, you just need to click on whichever video uh, you want to vote for, or you can also vote in the description. Isn't that right, Squid? That's right, Stamps. Good job at explaining. That's right. That's what you have to do to vote. Anyway, um, we got to go now, because I've got to go feed the mules, Stamps, so I'm uh, getting a bit hungry. Well, so. shall we talk about video, next week, go? though? Um, I don't really know about next week. It's not happened yet. Well, so we can't. We don't have to be too specific. <laughs> well, so uh, next week's building time, uh, we're going to do a, another special, and uh, what it's going to be is that uh, we're going to be using the modern texture pack. And so basically, the modern Ooh. texture pack is modern. So you know things like. Uh, like crafting <laughs> tables look like washing machines and stuff. So it's all like very modern and realistic. Okay. Was that on the um the, the like how you buy the texture pack? You know the little description. Was that how it how it came about? Was it like here's the modern texture pack? It it is modern. It's like it's like modern and stuff. It. So basically like it? so we can you can dress up in a suit or as a doctor. So everything's modern and oh. realistic. Ooh. Okay. So bear that in mind. So when uh, you're suggesting in the the copy uh, the in the copet in the comments what <laughs> I, I was gonna say the comments and it's topic. still recovering stuff. I mix I mix let, let him let him off. I mix comments and topic. I went compits. Yeah. So oh uh, yeah. So leave in the comments. <laughs> Your topic. He's revolted. <laughs> and uh, bear in mind that we're going to be building something modern. So if you say like a uh, medieval castle, it won't be chosen. You've got to leave a suggestion a for something modern. A modern medieval castle. A modern med <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you all un you don't need me to speak. You understand, Squid. You take it from here. I'm I done. Think, I think. I think we should do it a bit different, mate. I think we should do it a bit different. I think what we should do, since we've had a topic, I think we should just have modern. I think that should be the thing, because we always end up with very similar things. I reckon we should have a bit of uh, separation. No, I, I, th I think modern's a little bit too open. I, I think that think? is I think that is too maybe, many maybe possibilities. Maybe like modern building. Yeah, okay, maybe <laughs> modern build. Okay, you, you need to suggest a modern building, okay? And then and then and we're going to pick that, and that's going to be for next week. So make sure you leave that as a, a comment down below. But in terms of this week, we are done for building time. We're done. We'll see you later. We'll have to go pet some mules again. Okay. <laughs> to get hungry quite a lot. Go on, Stamps, go pet your mule. Oh, I'm feeling better what? already. No, Stamps, that's not petting, that's... You're hurting them. Well, I'm, I'm, oh. I have a very rough pet. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Anyway, we're going to go before Stamps kills some more mules. Thanks for watching, guys. So see you later. Bye! Bye! <laughs> <laughs>